Hello! In this tutorial, I'll show you how to disable overlay on Epic Games. Disabling the Epic Games overlay can enhance your gaming performance and reduce potential conflicts with other applications. So while the Epic Games launcher doesn't offer a direct option to disable the overlay, through its settings, you can achieve this by renaming specific overlay files. And I'm going to walk you through the process. Now, navigate to the overlay directory. So, open the file explorer page. And once you do that, just go to um, the following part. I'm going to walk you through. So, um, head over to... Okay, so I'm going to walk you through that part again. So open the file explorer and click on C, local disk. So once you click on C, local disk, go ahead and click on program files x86. Double click on it and click on Epic Games. Double click on it and click on launcher. Double click on it and click on portal. Double click on it and click on extras and you're going to find overlay double click on this now if the overlay files aren't in this location they might be in an alternative directory just find it now launch any game via the epic games launcher okay now launch any game via the epic games launcher and press control.alt.dell and open the tax manager now find the process named esos overlay renderer so i'm going to minimize this uh, launch any game i can't play any game because i don't have a game to play all right but just launch any game i can't play any game because i have not purchased any game so launch any game and click on control control alt and delete so i'm gonna walk that mm. Okay, Control Alt Dell. So you have this here. I'm just really going to cancel it because so um, click on Tax Manager. And once you click on Tax Manager, go ahead and find the process named um, um, ESOS Overlay Renderer. On that processes so like i said i have not um what's it called i don't have a game on i don't have a game on so if you have a game then you should definitely find esos overlay renderer then just right click it okay i'm going back to process so once you find esos renderer Right click on it. So let's say, imagine this is it. Right click on it. And once you right click on it, go ahead and click on um, open file location. And once you click on open file location, this will direct you to the folder containing the overlay executables. All right. So in the identified folder, just go ahead and locate the following files I'm going to show you. That's ESOS overlay renderer minus win64 minus shipping.exe you're going to find it then you're going to also find eos sorry not esos rather eos o server eos overlay renderer minus win32 minus shipping.exe then rename each file by adding a suffix such as dot bak to the file name so for example if you have es eos 
s over lay when draw minus wing six to four minus shipping the x is going to be you just it's going to be renamed to eos over lay render minus win 64 minus shipping dot x in dot b a k so just add dot b a k as a suffix to all the other files and just rename them so renaming these files prevents the overlay from launching then close any warning games and exit the epic games uh, launcher completely then restart the launcher to apply the changes that's it so to restore overlay functionality just rename the files back to their original names by removing the suffix so disabling the overlay may affect in-game features that rely on it such as social interactions or achievements the modifying program files can have unintended consequences so ensure that you understand the changes you're making and consider backing up the original files before proceeding now by following the steps you can effectively disable the um, epic games overlay potentially improving your gaming experience so go about the tutorial from the top to the bottom to get acquainted with the steps and once you're done you'll be good to go i hope this tutorial marvelously helped your search